Trayvon Martin, 10 years now. The third year of the pandemic is here. Invasion and war in the Ukraine, it just gets worse. So we get better at being who we are, a community of faith deepening our spiritual lives, undergirding our witness in the world, standing for justice, working for peace, living lives of grace and love. And the greatest of these is love. This month at Riverside, we're back in the nave and singing while we are also online. If you look up while you're in the nave, you'll see the scaffolding on the west, the Riverside Drive side, to support work that will begin on the stained glass windows. We've been here before and the work will take some time to complete. Lament to Alleluia is our theme. There will be wonderful preaching and music beginning this Sunday from Union Seminary, Claudio Carvales, and later in the month, Kelly Brown Douglas. Prayer and fasting begin this Friday at 6.25 a.m., as we did during Advent every Friday. Prayer at sunrise and fasting throughout the day. Check the website for the link. After two long years, Space for Grace resumes Wednesday, March 16th, in person in Assembly Hall, and online for the first time. And this is Women's History Month. There'll be a service of Evensong by the Riverside Choir on March 20th. See the website for more details. We're living in hard times, and the month will be hard as well. But grace abounds in every circumstance. Grace and peace. <laughs> 